Hi folks, Max from Nexus4Root.com for this week's custom ROM of the week. Uh, please check out Illusion ROM. Actually, I've started running this on so, several of my other phones, like uh, the, the Note 2 S2. Um, looking pretty well, and I've gotten some feedback that it runs really well on the Mako Nexus 4. And uh, I've tried it out, and it works really well. And uh, one of the things that I forgot to point out in my other videos is that this one does come with a keyline pie. What you're seeing is actually keyline pie. To get this, just go to settings and go to themes and switch from the default system theme to keyline pie, hit apply, and you'll be able to enjoy the latest keyline pie from Android 5.0, which has been leaked. Um, also, you get a bunch of uh, keyline pie wallpapers. Give it a second here. Oops, let's go to, there we go. You know, it's kind of loading from the internet, so you get uh, you get like a bunch of them. There we go. These are all key lime pie wallpapers. Actually, I think there's only three of them. Yeah, um, that's pretty nice. And you can see the transition animation is really cool. Um, let me show you again. See that? See how everything just kind of going boom, bottom from the bottom up, from the left to right. Uh, all that good stuff. This is an Android 4.2.2 ROM. Very solid ROM. Uh, there we go. For the Mako uh, Nexus 4. Um, you get the dark UI if you want to make everything dark. Um, this also inverts some of your Google apps like Gmail, Play Store, uh, even your keyboard and stuff like that. Uh, if you go to interface, this is pretty much like ROM control, slightly different. Uh, this ROM is built off Slim ROM, so if you've been using Slim ROMs, uh, I'm not sure. I think it's similar to that. Uh, display, you get all of these options. Uh, sound, a bunch of stuff here. Camera shutter sound. Um, all the stuff you can adjust here, you'll be able to find it. And also, you can adjust the LCD density. Um, if you want to change it to tablet mode, you can do it right here. And uh, I'll have a link to my uh, AOKP ROM control settings for those of you who are kind of new to all of this customization. Uh, breathing mist calls is nice. Halo, you get the latest Halo settings uh, from Paranoid Android. Um, so very nice. It's sort of like an AOKP ROM control uh, mixed in with Halo. Some of the latest features here. And this Pi control is pretty cool um, because you'll be able to actually set the different buttons. Uh, it's not the Pi control from the Paranoid Android, uh, but it's another one that allows you to add your shortcuts to your favorite apps. Um, which I like better because you know I use Pi Control mostly for the shortcuts. Um, so very nice ROM and performance is pretty darn good on this also. And probably some of you are running this already. And also for running your apps in tablet or custom VPI mode, you can use the Expose Installer and Expose App Settings. I also have a full tutorial guide on that. I'll have a link to that if you're new to all of this. Um, you can check that out. And that's pretty nice ROM. This is one of the hottest ROMs out there. So definitely check it out for your Nexus 4. Um, and I should be sh uh, posting the Android 4.3 with root uh, shortly on my site. So check back for that at nexus4root.com. And as always, if you have a Nexus 4, don't forget to sign up for my email list at nexus4root.com. We update you once a week with ROM of the Week tips, hacks, and more. And also, if you're on YouTube, please hit that like button for me here, subscribe button there. And I will see you guys soon. Stay high on Android.